Are you struggling to concatenate strings in your HTML attributes while using Angular? It can be a bit tricky, but don't worry. Today, we're going to simplify this process for you. I totally get it. Trying to combine strings dynamically in your HTML can feel like solving a puzzle with missing pieces. You're not alone in this. Many developers face similar challenges. Here's the specific question we're addressing. One user asked, how can I concatenate a string in an HTML attribute using Angular? They want to create an input tag name that combines Colitsina with a dynamic value from their object. Sound familiar? Let's dive in. So what's the issue here? In Angular, you can use expressions to bind data dynamically, but concatenating strings directly in HTML attributes can be a bit confusing. Let's break it down step by step and stick around. At the end of this video, I'll share a quick tip that will make your Angular development even smoother. To concatenate a string in an HTML attribute using Angular, the user should start by modifying the input tag in their HTML code. Instead of using the plus sign directly in the attribute, they should use Angular's binding syntax. Next, the user should ensure that the property they want to concatenate, in this case, idrana, is correctly referenced from the Jello object. This ensures that the concatenation works as expected. Now, the user should check the rest of their HTML structure to ensure that it is properly formatted. This includes making sure that all Angular directives are correctly applied. Finally, the user can test their changes by running the application and checking if the input fields display the concatenated names correctly. This will confirm that the implementation is successful. Fun fact, did you know that Angular was developed by Google? It's a powerful framework that makes building dynamic web applications a breeze. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution provided by another user suggests a simpler way to concatenate strings in your HTML attribute. Instead of using the plus sign, you can directly include the variable within the quotes. They recommend using this syntax, name equals Colitsina space, and then the variable Adrana inside the quotes. Additionally, the user shared a link to a working example on Plunker for better understanding. This can help you visualize how the solution works in practice. Here's a pro tip. Always remember to use Angular's binding syntax for dynamic attributes. It saves you from a lot of headaches and makes your code cleaner. And there you have it. You should now be able to concatenate strings in your HTML attributes with ease. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips, and don't forget to check out our next video for more Angular tricks.